Champ! You're going to face Otis in the finals tonight. Nice, Troy. Succinct, to the point, minimum attitude. One of these days, you'll be a real boy. That's one of those references, isn't it? Ah, life is full of mystery. Otis, huh? No shocking twist? You think Miz and I are so predictable? Well, yeah. Fine. Otis will be your opponent in the King of the Ring finals. Along with Chad Gable in a two-on-one handicap Universal match. title on the line. Got it. After I win, does Miz crown me himself, or does he send his stooge? Who's Miz's stooge? Oh, you mean me. When this is all said and done, I expect a full bow before your new king. The Alpha Academy is here. Byron, I've always wanted to do this. The resilient WWE Universal Champion faces what might be his toughest test. A two-on-one handicap match for his title and the King of the Ring Tournament crown. Will it be a coronation or frustration? If the Dark Horse does fall in this one after coming so close, the frustration will be off the charts. But win, and he just might silence any remaining critics who say his title isn't earned. The King of the Ring tournament and a load of respect is on the line. You might say it's go throne or go home. Or you might not. Driving down a forearm into their jaw. it right back. Uh-oh. Arm drag provides an escape. Chicken wing hoisted up and face first. Look at all these oh my God. Showing absolutely no mercy at all. What an onslaught. Is why they have the gold on their waist. And a slam. And Gable's hopes are waning in this one. You gotta wonder what does this do to Gable's confidence? That was a furious assault from the champion. Each blow coming in harder than the last. The challenger not looking good right now. Not sure if I'd panic, but certainly some cause for concern here. Oh, nasty flipping senton. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. No, 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 that'll break his arm. Vicious. Uh-oh, Nothing fancy there. Oh, this is an incessant attack being brought to him. Yeah, he has really hit a brick wall here. Powerbomb. A powerbomb's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Well placed, knees to the hamstring. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. From the outside, are you kidding me? Wait, wait a no minute. No way. Wait a minute. No way. Don't do it! Explorer suplex! Just an incredible amount of lower body strength displayed there. Oh, goodness, that looked bad. Quickly applies a side headlock. And look at this superstar. Nice drop toe hold. Going to back suplex coming. No! Face buster is unique. Look at this. Jarring impact. Able to reverse that one. Ooh. Oh, what a kick. And again to the back of the head. Yes, tag. Super kick. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. Oh, hard impact. 
trapped in the corner. Reversal catches Otis there. Fends off the attack with an elbow. Kick to the gut. I have a theory what's coming next. No, oh, the taxi up. I think the champ's got it. He delivers the leg drop. And the resolve of Otis might be wavering, but Otis can't allow this to hinder him. And then a standing moonsault. to the top. Superplex. Wow. Turning this into the final cut. Cover. Two. Title match stays alive. Now is not the time to wallow in dis... Here we go. Oh, God. Wildly throwing your body out of the ring like that is more often than not going to provide such a result. That was an example of boldness backfiring. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah. Here we go. No mercy being shown to Gable here. Gable has to gather the energy to turn the tables. Uh-oh. Broke out with a fist to the face. Could be what he needed to ignite a rally. Takedown. Put it with a cross face. It's cinched in. This could be over. Oh, I'm going to tap out here. But it... We're going to free the arm and does just that. Oh, what a kick. Again to the back of the head. Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it. I'm out of here. He's testing fate here in danger of a countout. From the top. All the way to the outside. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. Unpacks a well-placed punch. And he's sadly taking control here. It is all going his way right about now. Yank right up the ankle. Oh, no. Escape. Oh, the challenger not looking good right now. Still, this is about as good a position you could hope to be in this late in a handicap match. Excellent ring IQ to see the refs count and return to the ring in time. Down with a DDT. It's going for something else, it seems. Swinging away from Otis. Any of Otis's defenses have been pegged. Big knee to the midsection. Oof. Over and over. Establishing complete control. And the DDT. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Champ with a media kick out there. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Dragon suplex. Tagged into action. Oh man, he has fired up now. He's returning fire. Oh, that's going to be interesting. Kick to the midsection. Oh, look at this. Ataxia. But champions need to finish the job. Ripped in the hard way. Covered by the champ. Kicked out. Right to the kidneys from behind. Those last hits rattled the champ. Yeah, but at this point in a handicap match, you have to expect some. Oh, big Otis. Oh, the dominance of Otis with that slam. We can have a new champion. Not even a two count. What unbelievable power. He skirts around. Stick to the gut. I have a theory what's coming next. No, the taxi up. Can it be? 
Will the rain continue? Uh oh, look out. Double leg drop. stacked against the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, and he overcame. This is an insult to the crown, Cole. An insult, Corey? The Miz forced the champ to defend his title in every match of this tournament. You need to put some respect on his name. All hail King Dark Horse. Hail this, Saxton. I will never respect that man, whether he's wearing a crown or not. The new king just defeated two opponents to win the tournament. Which Good news. Miz is finally ready to have that face-to-face -face you've been begging for ever since you got back from NXT. It's about time. Should I go to his office? Oh, no. He wants to see you in the ring after your next match. <laughs> okay. What does Miz have planned this time? It's nothing to be worried about. Just go take care of business in your match, and then you'll get your face time with the boss. When it comes to you two, I don't believe for a second that there's nothing to be worried about. But if this is the only way I can get the Miz to stop dodging me, then I'll do it. This is exciting. It's the start of a brand new chapter. <laughs> if you say so. Great action unfolding here on SmackDown as our WWE Universal Champion takes on Santos Escobar in a non-title encounter. The Dark Horse has been in the doghouse since his trip down to NXT. Maybe GM Miz will throw him a bone soon. Why should he? The champion abandoned Miz and SmackDown. If it were up to me, he'd be taking up permanent residence in that doghouse. Just showing off at this point. Showing absolute control of the situation. Oh! There's one. He does. This third one makes it. Series of suplexes shifting all the momentum in their favor here. Boom! Escobar on the receiving end. Rainboy with the chop. Getting their opponent set up. A little bit of flash on the side. Off the ropes. Knees up, got the knees up at the last second. him pay with a counter. Oh, what a kick, and again to the back of the head. Looking wobbly in the corner. Positioning their opponent. On the middle rope, backbreaker into the final cut. Digging knuckles right into the skull. This has got to hurt. The atomic noogie. Looking to hurt him here. Oh, what a shoulder breaker. Foot to the midsection. Santos falling victim to an onrush now. Yeah, Santos has run into a roadblock. Oh. Vicious right forearm. He manages to escape it. Close line! Oh my god! Up the turnbuckles! What's he gonna do? That's insane! That was a long two count there. Taking their opponent all the way up with the Canadian racket. Face first into a DDT. Cover! Two! No, he gets the shoulder up. That is just pure instinct. Wait, 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 wait! The count was stopped before it started. How? for every 
everything. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. And that one misses the mark. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Kick to the gut. I have a theory what's coming next. The old Ataxia. Escobar's in serious danger. Two. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion with another victory in his impressive reign. He's been on an absolute tear since he was stripped of the NXT Championship. It certainly seems to have given him some extra up. motivation. Well, here's the source of that extra motivation, The Miz. I know you've been dying to have it out with me face to face since your little trip down to NXT. But I've been working on something that makes it so I don't ever need to talk to you again. Something that makes you irrelevant. And not just to me, but the entire WWE Universe. Because let's get one thing straight. I wasn't going to sit back and let you jump ship and steal my WWE Universal Championship again. No! I'm taking control of my brand's most important asset by creating a new one. So as we head down the road to WrestleMania, it's my pleasure to announce that SmackDown will send a champion to the Showcase of the Immortals who we can be proud of, not of. Universal Champion, forever in the shadow of Roman Reigns. But instead, someone whose star shines brighter than the universe itself. So allow me to introduce the first ever Multiversal Infinite Champion, Logan Paul! You've gotta be kidding me. Can Miz really do this? He can until someone with a bigger paycheck stops him. Finally, we have the must-see champion I've always wanted. Stop right there. You better not come any closer, because if you lay a hand on my real champion, you will face severe consequences. Besides, I don't need my new champion fighting someone who's meaningless. Now let's go to break with no shots of the irrelevant champion. I still can't believe Miz did this. The road to WrestleMania just took a very unexpected detour.